Ladies and gentlemen, if you want to use Codium in Visual Studio Code, I'm going to show you exactly how to install it and then also how you can go through and actually use Codium. So let's check it out. So the first thing you're going to do is jump into Codium.com and you're going to look for downloads and you're going to download the version for the Visual Studio Code, right? Presumably you have Visual Studio Code installed on your PC and on the bottom right hand side you'll see this pop up and um, you'll now be able to install Codium as an extension. Now another way of doing this is going to the left hand side here on your toolbar looking for extensions and just typing in Codium and you'll actually find it right here and you'll have this option over here it'll be install and not uninstall. So I've got Codium and there's a few ways that you can use it. You can see I've got my index document here and you're going to go ahead just highlight this you're going to right click and it gives you some options you've got the uh, refactor option and then you can also have it explained okay so let's just for example uh, let's go ahead and we're going to select a bunch of this over here let's say we're going to just select all of this let's right click and we can say explain this section and on the left hand side here you'll see this codium uh, it says connected and now it is explaining what is going on over here so um, as you can see a full explanation you can continue to ask questions over here um, for whatever reason you need to ask whatever questions you have you can go ahead and you can choose this now if you are upgrading you can use um, better or more advanced models but for now we are using just the basic which is more than fantastic again you're going to right click and you can just refactor this and over here gives you a list of commands and from these commands over here you can go and um, choose what you would like to do and it just assists you in terms of you know bettering your coding experience making it quicker so you're coding less you're um, giving more commands and letting codium do most of the work for you there we go so as you see there's a bunch more that you can do and you've got this toolbar on the left hand side over here which of course is fantastic and you can use it completely to your needs